Hey guys and welcome back to another episode of the Not So Berry Challenge. So I've taken it upon myself to play through several, several days. Uh, so when I first started, I think it said there was seven days until Sunny H is up or six. I can't remember exactly, but somewhere around there. Um, and now she's like a day away or not even a day away now, like half a day maybe. So we're going to be aging her up today as well as uh, Missy's going to be aging up as well. And I really wanted to just get uh, Cinder aged up this episode into a teen. Uh, so that's basically what my goal has been throughout, you know, playing all this. And uh, throughout that time, the only thing that happened really was um, Ash got a promotion in his career, which is awesome. And Sunny, I thought she was going to get one, but for some reason it wasn't in the excellent bar in her performance thing. So... Um, that's pretty much it that's happened. Other than that, we've, like, gone into space once. She upgraded the, uh, spaceship. So not really much has happened, you know, just a lot of, like, skill grinding. Oh, yeah, a big thing. Um, Cinder ended up leveling up to level 10 of the motor skill, and she fulfilled her aspiration. This was literally seven minutes ago. Uh, but I've been playing for about close to two hours, if not already two hours, because it started at around, like, nine... 9.50, like 10 o'clock or something like that, and it's now 12, 12 p.m., so, uh, I've been playing quite a bit, and, uh, you know, that's that, so, I'm surprised Buttercup is still alive, because I thought she would have been dead by now, but thankfully, she's still holding on strong, she's gotten sick a couple times, and we've had to go to the vet, but the thing is, like, when we go to the vet, for some reason, they do not actually take care of your dog, so I ended up going ahead and buying a table. I got rid of the uh, ball pit because she's about to age up anyway, so there's no point in having it anymore. And I ended up getting a vet table to take care of Buttercup because she's been getting sick quite a bit. And Sunny is now leveling up in the vet skills. She's level 3 now. So, yeah, and we've been having her work on handiness skills. Let's see, what else have we done? Yeah, pretty much she's level 8 of handiness, which is great. So, as soon as we finish this, we'll be able to head over to Oasis. Oh, no, we live in Oasis Rings. But we'll, we'll be able to head over to that area where she can open it. So, I'm excited for that. I'm just trying to, you know, bang out some of the objectives of, you know, her generation so that we can, you know, move on sooner. Plus, we only have... Uh, not that many episodes left. I miscalculated how many we have left last time. Uh, because I literally thought that we were on episode, did I say 38 or 37? You know, see, I can't even remember. So I'm just not even going to talk about it because my memory does not serve me right, <laughs> unfortunately. But it's okay. Uh, and I need to finish reaching level 10 in comedy skill because I want to be able to finish his, um, aspiration. And I discovered that his mom died and I didn't even know. So rest in peace, Trisha. I'm really excited for Cinder to turn into a teenager. Like, you guys don't even understand. Like, I'm super, super excited. Uh, ooh, I'm just, I can't wait. I think I'm more excited about the makeovers and just her growing up as a teen and, like, moving on to her generation soon. But she's been working on motor so much. Like, I was surprised. I kept on having her go upstairs and doing the typing game. Because uh, one of the things was to reach... Uh, a high score in the typing game, and I didn't even know that was a thing. So, you know, the more you learn, uh, it's almost Misty's birthday. Yes, I am aware. I'm re oh, I just want to age them up. I haven't changed the bedrooms yet because I was going to wait until all the kids just, you know, become kids, and then I'll, like, do, like, a whole thing for it because, I mean, it's not really that bad right now anyway, but um, I'm going to be changing up Misty's room for sure. And I might end up switching their bedrooms because this one is a little bit bigger, and I feel like for a teen bedroom, they'll, it'll be there'll be more space in here. So I think that's what I'll do when Cinder turns into a teen. Okay. And she already has an A in school, so she's doing really, really well. Uh, I'm very proud of her, so we have not much to worry about with her. There's a game on the computer that she can play to work on mental, too, which I didn't even know. It's called Arithmetic Attack. Jeez, say that ten times fast. Oh my god, I probably wouldn't be able to. Let me see. Uh, <laughs> arithmetic attack. See, I was... <laughs> I couldn't even get through the first one. <laughs> arithmetic attack. Arithmetic attack. It's arithmetic <laughs> yeah. So, um, good luck. <laughs> Let me know if you were able to do it in the comments. Is this what breakfast scramble looks like? I'm sorry, this looks... Oh no, that's mushrooms in it. Mm-mm. Not for me, I hate mushrooms. 
No, no, no. I love how they run. Like, it's so funny. <laughs> Honey, where are you going? Please, what? Hacker? Hacker, you can't do that. She just reached through the... Girl, how long are your arms? Are you freaking Elastigirl or whatever her name is from Incredibles? Should you be watching this? The Walking Dead? Honey. <laughs> when you're shook. <laughs> okay, I need to stop. All right, let's go ahead and speed through time here and just kind of wait until it pops up that there's zero days left, which I mean should be really, really soon. Because uh, currently it just says one. I just want to age her up, you know? Okay, I think I'm gonna actually have her wake up because she's not too, uh, she's not in a bad mood at all. So I just gotta get her, go to the bathroom real quick. And I think we'll just prepare a birthday cake now. Just say zero days. There we go, awesome. So we can go ahead and cook a hamburger cake and we'll age them up. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Do you keep turning on the radio? Oh yeah, last episode I thought this radio came with Sunny's aspiration, or not aspiration, career, but it was actually, uh, what's his name ashes so yeah i didn't even i don't even know why i thought that came with sunny for some reason i completely forgot that he was in the entertainment industry so the more you know okay oh no she's peeing herself oh sunny now she's gonna be all stanky girl just oh all right, that's enough for now. We can do it later. All right, let's go ahead and help blow out candles for Misty. Jeez. You had to pee yourself. You couldn't have gone when I told you to go. This is what happens if you don't listen. All right, go. All right, let's just steal her from the dog. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Okay. Wait a second. Hold your horses. There we go. <laughs> Oh, it looks like she was kissing her forehead. What's smelling? Is it her? I don't know. Okay, so we're gonna make her... I think we'll do creative. And we'll do... Hmm. What should we do? Uh, we're gonna make her a geek. Okay. Now you go ahead and add birthday candles. Yay! So now she is a full-blown adult. Oh my gosh. Yes, girl. Work it, honey. Okay. So we can just add birthday candles to this so we don't waste the cake. Why are you trying to get in the oven, honey? Like, what? What are you doing? Who the heck is McKinley? Girl, what? Oh, wait. Wrong person. Hold on. Uh, add birthday. Why are you embarrassed? Oh, because you peed your pants. It's okay. Nobody really saw. I promise. I didn't even see. What? You peed your pants? I don't remember. All right, so here we have Miss Misty. Uh, I don't know, another simple outfit. I just, I'm kind of running out of gray girl clothing that I haven't really worn. So I have this one for her. And that's pretty much it that I did. And that's her up close. She pretty much looks like all her other siblings. So, <laughs> I mean. Uh, anything else that we can sell? We have quite a bit. I was going in through her inventory and selling stuff that we don't need. Or that we have duplicates of, like, posters and stuff. Which, I mean, we have three of these. We could sell these. Oh, we can't. Never mind. When you think you have a money opportunity, but you actually don't. Sad times. We'll actually have her just keep crafting furniture. And I've been going into, um, into build mode and, like, selling the stuff that she's been crafting. Because it's worth a lot of money. So I obviously want to make money back from it. And so I've been doing that as well as we've been, you know, working on uh, crafting stuff. So Stormy's working on her homework. Cinder, she's, yeah, we'll have her wake up so that she can go ahead and eat because I don't think she's done her homework. No, actually she did. But we can have her do extra credit just for the sake of it. Uh, do extra credit. Oh my God, and here's Ash breaking it down, honey. Okay, okay, I see you. Have we, oh yeah, I forgot I had him go um, search. So we can go ahead and sell this stuff too. Oh my God. We have to pay our bills too, but they're really expensive. How much are they? 15600 So I'm trying to make us enough money to pay for them. Oh, I think we have enough though, don't we? To pay? Yeah, we do. Okay, go ahead and pay the bills just so that we have that out of the way. Because the power is going to get shut off today if we don't actually pay them. 
and I don't want to risk that so let's go and do that first all right she finished working on that do you have work today I think you do yeah you have work in two hours so I want to get her to finish some of these things up prior to going to work let's go ahead and see if she's actually had any other things made planters oh yeah her her bar stools did you already pay the bills and not we they didn't take the money from it oh my god we should just make dining tables honestly that just gave us so much money did he pay the bills did he pay pay the bill okay he did it i was gonna say i was like how the heck did we like pay them but not get my <laughs> but our money's still there i think i'm just gonna have her make dining tables from now on i feel because if that's gonna make us a lot of money i mean might as well right other sources of income i greatly appreciate you guys oh wait grayson did you do your homework oh let me do that oh <gasps> grayson do your homework oh my god <sighs> my children all right buttercup is still in there hanging strong okay we, they didn't even do their projects i mean cinder did hers like uh two days ago but i haven't had them do theirs because i don't really care as much because Cinder's the one that we're going to be focusing on the most anyway. Uh, but now, oh, I forgot to say that she actually has another skill that's physically gifted. So it says, from completing the rambunctious scamp aspiration, physically gifted sims build adult physical skill faster. So I'm really excited because that's going to be perfect for us. Because we're definitely going to need that. Um, okay, so she ages up in one day. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, go ahead and, oh, she says heading off to work, right? No, no, she's playing basketball. All right, okay, you can do that, honey. You do you, have fun, play some basketball, girl. You know, missing shots is nice, too. Oh, she just literally want. she gave up. That's me. <laughs> okay, uh, Grayson, you're doing homework. Okay, he's almost done, so uh, he'll be able to head off to school and not be too late. All right, you guys better head off to school before you guys are too late and we start getting calls from your freaking principal asking where you are. Why? He only has three tasks here, and it says that his queue is full. Like, where? Where? No! Why is that a thing? Like, every time they go off the monkey bars, they always have to make a mess. Apparently, it's not helping. That's so weird. Because they're talking. Hmm. I don't like that. Oh, <gasps> no! No! Buttercup! I thought we had some more time with you! No! Oh! I was like, oh, she's living her best life. Like, she's doing so well. Buttercup! I'm sad now. No, can we, like, plead? Can we plead? If we can't, I'm gonna plead. Cause I wanna live, I wanna make her live for a little bit longer. Where is he? Can we plead? One does not plead with death before the reaping, lest ye be reaped. <gasps> Please. Oh my God. I want her to live at least a little bit longer. Please. <sighs> I wasn't going to, but like, I kinda, I just love Buttercup. Can we plead? Hello? Can we not plead? Hello? Can I not? Sir, let me plead. <gasps> ah! What? It wouldn't let me. No! Bring her back to life. Hello? Why wouldn't it let me plead? Can you not plead for dogs? <gasps> Buttercup. That's not fair. You freaking... You just... No. No, no not friendly introduction. Be rude to him. Rude. Rude. Why didn't you let me plead for my dog? Freaking yell at him. Buttercup, I don't know where to put you. 
Okay, I'm gonna put her like right here, I think. We'll put some flowers. Oh, hold on, I'll be right back. All right, I went ahead and added a few flowers here and some candles to mourn our little doggo here. I'm not Man, I literally wasn't expecting it to be, like, then. Like, I thought it wasn't going to happen for at least, like, a day or two, maybe. I'm sad. I'm going to miss her. Like, I actually, like, I feel like I was a little bit more attached to Buttercup than I was to Raz. Oh, is he mourning? Oh, come over here, bud. Um, someone suggested that we could probably get another dog and it would maybe a Great Dane, which I'm not opposed to doing, but I think we'll give him a bit of time to mourn. Buttercup first before they get a new dog since well it was unexpected and what's sad about it is that Sunny wasn't even here to like say goodbye to her either which really sucks in my opinion so I feel terrible for that fact because oh man she didn't get to witness her dog's death like that's so like I mean I guess it's better that way but at the same time she didn't get to say like a proper goodbye which oh Cinder and uh, Grayson just found out as well because they went and started mourning her. Oh, he's back again. I wish they would mourn her on this side instead of behind the hedge because it's really awkward positioning. But, aww. So the only one that doesn't know is Stormy yet and Sunny. So we'll see if they end up finding out on their own because they did. So, oh, man. I wonder if Sunny's going to get her promotion or not. That's what I'm really curious about. I feel like she will though. Oh, she definitely will. Oh, thank God. Okay. <gasps> Ooh, we get to pick one? I didn't know there was branches. Interstellar Smuggler. I've never gone this far before. So the sim who wrangles the most of the stars takes advantage of the ungoverned frontier. Take any job, even if it doesn't touch the ground. Rewards include a retro rocket ship. <gasps> 201 simoleons per hour. Ooh, we might do that one. You get more money for that. What does this one say? Space Ranger. Space is wild and unruly. A bit too unruly. Taking a post in the Planet Patrol ensures that space remains safe for future generations. Reward includes the Apollo rocket ship. Ooh. I like this one. I mean, look at all the, how much more money we make. This one does sound really awesome. But this one, I feel like I'm living for this one more. We're going to go ahead and go with this one instead. 4 p.m. to 12 a.m., 10 a.m. to... Okay, I like this timing better. Ooh, yes! So, promoted to Moon Mercenary. Oh, this is exciting. So, what is this, level 8? Oh, I'm... Ooh, I like that. Wait, what does that say? Space mission not started. Level 8 of fitness skill. Okay, we got this. Ooh. I feel like they haven't had dinner as a whole family in, in forever. So, actually, never. I think this might be the first time. Grayson, you know what? Might as well go ahead and grab a serving so we could have, like, a nice family dinner for once. Since we never do. No, no, no. You better sit right here, honey. No, no. Uh, 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 uh. Sit here. Sit here. No, no, no. You two. Where, you, where do you guys think you're going? Sit. Sit. No. Are you guys serious? Sit at the table with your family. Forget it. I want to have one nice thing and you guys ruin it. I just want to have a nice family dinner. But y'all can't even appreciate that. Okay. Okay. Ash is actually going to be aging up quite soon. He has 11 days and Sunny still has like 20 something. Yeah, 20 days. So he's going to be gone a lot sooner than she will be, which is crazy because I didn't expect for him to be that much older. But it's because she got pregnant so many times that, you know, her aging got pushed back so much, which is crazy. So they would have been at the same rate. So it is now 1 a.m. and we can go ahead and age up Cinder because there's zero days left. So Cinder, come on down and blow out your candles. Oh, she's gonna be a teen. I need to go ahead and actually look up the skills that she needs to get because I actually don't know what they're supposed to be or not skills, um, traits. Okay, so I found the traits. So it's active slob music lover, and then aspiration is bodybuilder, and the career is athlete. So we gotta remember to do that. So I'm gonna have her go ahead and wake up now and have her get ready to age up. I was getting really frustrated because I was trying to find the rules, but nothing would load. Not my phone, not my laptop. On my PC it didn't, and then finally it loaded on my phone. So 
It took a while. All right. Time to age up. Come on. I believe you got this. The strength in them lungs. Yay. <gasps> there we go. Okay, so um, we're going to do the athletic bodybuilder aspiration. And what was the other one? We're going to do music lover first and then we're going to do slob because we don't like being a slob. So let's go ahead and do music lover. Ah, okay. So I'm going to go ahead and create a sim. All right. So I went ahead and gave Cinder her makeover. So I gave her three different outfits. They're pretty similar to each other though, but I don't really mind it. So that's the second outfit. And then her third one is like a jean. Actually, everything has jeans in it. I just realized. I feel like this dress is a little bit messed up, but I can't tell if it's just because the way she's standing. Uh, it could be that it's like that, but um, other than that, I really do like that. And I didn't do any of her other outfits except for her athletic wear and her sleepwear. So that's pretty much it. I have her hair down for this one because, well, she's not going to sleep with her hair in a ponytail. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much all I have for her makeover. I love how she thinks that this is, uh, quality selfie content. <laughs> like, what is she doing with her lips? Girl, honey, I don't think that that's, um, normal. Uh, oh, she likes it, though. Okay, so I guess if she likes it, then we should be happy. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so that is Sunny. I mean, not Sunny. What's your name again? Cinder. So, oh, man, I love these jeans so much. Um, but what I'm probably going to do is end up uh, switching up these rooms, obviously, off camera. Because uh, I want Cinder to have um, more space in her room. Because I put the double bed in here. It's probably going to be really tight. So, we're going to definitely do that. And what are you doing? Oh, are you taking a shower? Okay. Uh, so, I think with that being said, I'm probably going to go ahead and end this episode off here. So, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll talk to you guys in a new video very soon. Bye, guys.